guys, welcome to the Black Apron Cooking Show. I'm your host and chef, Jeremiah, and today we have a special guest, my friend Marissa. Hi guys, um, let me just say that this is one of my favorite cooking shows, and that this is the cooking show to tune into for all your cooking needs. And today we'll actually be starting off with a dish that's closer to my culture, but I'm from the Bahamas, so we're gonna start off with a tropical conch salad, and actually this is how it goes. Let's get to it, I'm excited. So, Chef, we're cooking tropical kung salad today. Okay. Tell me what do we need to start first. So today you'll actually need two pieces of kung, one pineapple, mango, lime, scotch bonnet pepper. Mm -hmm. This is something that we actually use in the Bahamas. Yeah, I've or, never seen that before. Well, it's, more, it's more like Caribbean. Okay, an anything. island thing. Yeah, okay, more gotcha. Caribbean. Mm -hmm. um, you need tomato, an onion and an orange. Let me ask you this, bees. Where can I find these in a grocery store? Um, you could find them at. I've like, never seen them before. <laughs> so you can actually find them at like with Dixie or Publix. Okay. Okay. So they are around. Right. They actually are around. Okay. Cool. So let's get started. I'm excited. All right, Marissa. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut the onions up while you go ahead and wash these vegetables off for me. Okay. I'm excited to see you cut this. Yeah, now when you're cutting, can you use like pretty much any kind of knife? Just because, I mean, I'm no chef. I can cook, don't get me wrong, but. So it would be prefer me to use a chef knife than anything. Okay. That's one of like the main knives we use in the kitchen. Okay. I'm actually gonna dice the onions up and I'm gonna dice everything else after. Okay. So oh. after the onions, what, what do you recommend we cut next? Uh, I mean, I know it really doesn't matter, but what would you prefer? Usually I prefer to do a sweet pepper next. Okay. Um, and then? And then well, I we'll usually, cut the orange last, right? Because it's the fruit. Right, right. Actually, it's the juice. Okay. It's actually the juice, so. So are there cut up pieces of oranges, like, in the actual? No, we'll just be using the juice from the orange. So we'll we gotta squeeze it. it. We'll squeeze it like oh, how we okay, squeeze okay, the lime. Okay. We'll squeeze the lime and we'll squeeze the orange. Okay. Actually. Gotcha. Now, so there's no cut up pieces of lime in the in the salad. No. Nah. Okay. No cut up. Pieces. Is it like a sauce? Yeah. Does it come with like a juice or uh, is it just straight? The juice, cream? actually, the juice comes from the lime and the orange. They give you that sweet, lemony taste. Okay, so it does sit in like a sauce and kind of like marinate. Correct. Okay. Gotcha. Okay, so we're gonna speed this process up. Okay. I'm going to dice everything else up and show you the guys the finished product. Cut it, 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 cut it. Them bricks is way too high, you need to cut it. Your price is way too high, you need to cut it. Cut it, 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 cut it. Cut it. Them bricks is way too high, you need to cut it. Your price is way too high, you need to cut it. Looks pretty good to me. And then you added what, salt and pepper? Yeah. So just pour now. Uh oh, I may need some assistance. Mm -hmm. So we don't make a mess. This looks amazing, guys. Messy. I'm making a mess. <laughs> Alrighty. Now, what do you top it off with? Um, we usually top it off with some orange. Fresh orange. Fresh orange. You're gonna squeeze that. That's a big orange. <laughs> <laughs> and then we're gonna use some lime to come across it. This looks amazing. Now, what do we have to top it off with? Um, I usually top it off with plantain chips. Okay. It actually goes really, really good with it. I don't know you if just you kind of sprinkle them on there? Just sprinkle it or just place it right there in the middle. Okay. Not all over the place. Now, mm. are we up for tasting? Can I taste now? And don't mind me, I smell everything before I eat it. <laughs> no problem. So while we're tasting, can you tell me a little bit more about, more, a little bit more about your business? Yes, definitely. Um, well, my business is 
way different than this here. This seems more fun. Um, taste and food. But I have a women's clothing store. Um, we cater from the age of 18 to about, we'll just say on up. Because, you know, you have those older women who don't look necessarily their age or they just have a younger person style. So, um, yeah, we cater um, to women of all ages and all sizes. We do have plus size. Um, we go up to a size 3X. And, yeah, that's about it. So, guys, if you like what you're seeing here today and what we made, you can like, comment, share, and subscribe. You can also find my business information below. Uh, the website is DramaticMiami.com, and you can follow us on Instagram at DramaticMiami also. And also Facebook. Alrighty, and you can hashtag iChefYouEat. iChefYouEat. Thank you, guys. Have a good one.